Time now for a segment brought to you by Bayada Home Health Care. This morning, we welcome directors Lindsay Jamie and Rick Boschwitz. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks so much for joining us. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having yeah, us. We've got your logo right yes. up there. Yeah. Looks Love great. It. Uh, and I can't wait to hear more about it. So, Lindsay, let's start with you. Can you sure. tell us a little bit about Bayada? Yeah, of course. So, Bayada is a family run business. Um, it started in 1975 in a garage in Philadelphia. Um, Mark had a vision to help people millions of people worldwide. Mm -hmm. And um, he's, he's accomplished that. We're at a point in time where we have almost 400 offices across the continental U.S., wow. including Hawaii and internationally. Really? Um, it's, a, it's a really amazing company to work for. So what are some of the services that you provide? Yeah, so my office provides assistive care services, uh -huh. um, and we can talk more about that, but there's also PT, uh, physical therapy, occupational therapy, skilled nursing, Rick's office. We provide pediatric and adult nursing wow. in the homes, we take mm -hmm. kids to school. About the staff itself, because in mm -hmm. order to do all of those sure. things, you need the people we to do it. We need the people, yeah. very much so. So mm -hmm. my office works with straight nursing. Mm -hmm. So again, we work with kids in their homes, we help them go to school. We are actually, we have a nurse residency program. Oh, so what that one. is, is College students who have just graduated are able to come work with us. There's a seven week accredited program mm -hmm. where they're going to get intense training, work in our simulation lab. They're going to get precepting out in the field. They're going to work with high tech oh, clients. Yeah, so these are kids who have trachs or are ventilator dependent. Mm -hmm. So they're going to get all that training. So they're not yeah. just going to be thrown into a setting at a hospital or a nursing, nursing home where they have multiple clients. They're yeah. trained and then when they're comfortable after those seven weeks and the preceptor's comfortable and everyone's comfortable, they'll start to work independently. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're actually meeting with Apprenticeship Rhode Island next Wednesday to certify that program mm -hmm. as an apprenticeship program here. It's nice that they can specify exactly to the needs, like you said, of their yes. clients. There might be specifications that maybe are touched upon loosely in like a, a larger yeah. curriculum, right. but you can really hone in on exactly what they need. I think yes. that's, that's remarkable. Yeah. Again, just some of the services that yeah. are provided. Absolutely. So, I mean, my office, we will do um, home care services so you know someone who wants to age gracefully in their home who mm -hmm. wants to stay safely at home um, their family works or you know they just need a little bit of extra yeah. whether it is um, you know meal preparation or some light housekeeping mm -hmm. or you know taking care of your furry family members yeah um, you, you know, don't want to lose showers that. <laughs> yeah all of that stuff that really improves the quality of life mm -hmm. our staff is able to do now, one of the great things is our, our offices are now working together yep. where Rick's office is... Yep. We're know, developing an aid to nurse program yes. great. where we're providing, we're providing sponsorships to Lindsay's CNAs to help with their tuition while they're going back to nursing school mm -hmm. to help them transition into their career yeah. and work with us in home care <laughs> because there's such a need, need for home care nursing right now and home yeah. care aids. It's <laughs> underfunded and we really need the help. Excuse Are you me. okay? <laughs> to clear my throat. She's really excited about she it. She is. I think so, right? <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. It's wonderful. You're setting them up for their opportunities, though, <laughs> for their careers. We want to make sure that they have an opportunity to to take care of their families while they're right. taking care of someone else's family. Right. Definitely. Mm -hmm. I need to take care of this cough. Excuse me. <laughs> Little times there. This segment was brought to you by Bayada. If you want more information, go to roadshow.com.